Good day, boys and girls. My name is Teacher Pia, and today I'm going to be your conversation teacher. Okay. Before we start with our lesson, I want you to prepare these. Number one, your S notebook or your English schoolwork notebook. Number two, an origami paper or a plain paper in any color and size. You can use AC paper if you want, pair of scissors, and last one is glue. Now, boys and girls, you can pause the video and prepare these materials. Now, boys and girls, before we start with our lesson, Teacher Pia is going to show you pictures and I want you to guess what is our lesson for today. Let's start. Okay, boys and girls, did you guess our lesson for today correctly? Correct! Very good! Today's lesson is all about origami. Okay, now what is origami? Origami is the art of folding objects out of paper. Now, maybe you are familiar with origami, boys and girls, because origami is a type of art where we fold papers to form objects. Origami is originated from Japanese. Oro, which means to fold, and kami, which means paper. So again, origami is an art wherein we fold paper to form objects or animals or anything. Now, boys and girls, Teacher Pia prepared examples of origami for you. Now, the first example we have a bird, an origami of bird. Next, a crab. The third one or the next one, a frog. We also have fish. Next one is a seahorse. And the last one is a snail. So today, boys and girls, earlier, Teacher Pia told you to prepare a paper, right? Because today, we are going to make a butterfly origami. Now, in making a butterfly origami, we are going to watch a video with steps to help us make a beautiful butterfly origami. Let's watch it. So today, boys and girls, we are going to watch a video clip about butterfly origami. Now that is a butterfly origami. Now, you're going to need a pair of scissors and papers. Boys and girls, in making origami, we have to use an equal side paper or a square paper. Now, if you use A4 paper, please cut this side of the paper by the use of the pair of scissors like this. After that, you will have like this, a square paper. Now, let's start. The first thing you're going to do is fold this corner and this corner, like this. Your paper should be like this, folded in this corner and this corner. The next one is we are going to fold another side of the square or another side of the paper. Okay. 
this side and this side. Fold it like this. Make sure to fold each sides evenly and fold it properly. Next, the other side. Make sure it is even, boys and girls. It should be like this. Now you can also fold it on the opposite side. Fold it in an opposite direction like this. Make sure to fold it evenly and fold it correctly. It should have like this. Corners and this side. Now find the triangle. triangle. Now after finding or locating the triangles, we are going to push the folded corners inside. This and this side, you're going to push it inside. Push it inside and fold it properly. Fold it properly and push the folded sides in. Now, boys and girls, you should have like this. Now, flip it over. You have the first and the second flaps. Now, Fold these flaps forward. Like this. That is our first flap. should be like this. Now let's fold our second flap like this. Now two flaps are folded. Now, the back should be like this. See the triangle? We are going to fold it. These are the flaps. And that is a small triangle. We are going to fold it like this. We are going to fold in the middle or in the center like this. Hold it in the center and open the flaps. Open the 
the flaps like this. There you have it, a beautiful butterfly origami. Okay, boys and girls, now, did you watch closely to the video? Did you listen to the steps? Okay, now, if you haven't finished with, with your butterfly origami, you can pause the video anytime and continue. If you are finished making your butterfly origami, you can get a glue and your S notebook. Now, what you're going to do is you're going to paste your butterfly origami on your S notebook. Now, you can make one or two. Teacher Pia has an example on the screen for you to be guided. You're going to write butterfly origami and below, you're going to paste your butterfly origami. This has been your conversation class and I am Teacher Pia, reminding you to stay at home, always wear your mask when you go out, and always wash your hands. See you in our next class. Goodbye and thank you!